British government says it is working on strengthening its relations with Zimbabwe. British ambassador to Harare, Peter Valls, uh, told reporters after a closed meeting with the ruling party's leadership that London is open to all channels of engagement. Basarangu, Kusindisa uh, Hukama, Way, Britain, near Zimbabwe. And so my, strength, my, my, my role is to do what I can to strengthen the relationship between Britain and Zimbabwe. There are lots of issues we talked about, but I think it's better that we have those uh, discussions with the government and, and political parties rather than uh, broadcast across the media. So I look forward to discussing those in the coming weeks and months uh, with the government. Uh, the party's director of information, Farai Marapira, said the engagements went smoothly. Uh, ambassador for United Kingdom Arimuno Zimbabwe. Auya kuti waone sane watora ni nyaji jinsi zino badanza la Commonwealth, ma sanctions, regime zino uta kuti nyikani Zimbabwe rambe shenda mbere. Saka ina uta tishamba shaka naka asi jinsi shanga shibuda ne kuti sisi nuko nuko kuti tuani atazacho asi sisi mu sanga nua shamba shaka naka. The country and Mozambique are exploring ways to maximize benefits from the Faruka pipeline for seamless operations and improved efficiencies. Zimbabwe and Mozambique are looking at ways to upgrade capacity at Faruka pipeline for seamless operations and improved efficiency. And this was revealed by Zimbabwe's leader, President Emerson Nangagwa, when he commissioned an ethanol plant in Mavuku earlier today. Riding on the long-standing mutual and beneficial relationship between Zimbabwe and Mozambique, the National Oil Infrastructure Company and Compania de Pipeline Mozambique-Zimbabwe Limited are synchronizing the capacity upgrade of the Feruka Pipeline for seamless operations and improved efficiencies between the two countries. Zimbabwe has lifted restrictions on imports of fertilizer as well as cement into Zimbabwe following shortages of the products. Uh, prices of cement in Zimbabwe have doubled over the past months, so while fertilizer is becoming difficult to come by as the farming season gets into full swing. Now, the country is forecasting below average rainfall with the impact of an El Nino expected to bring about drought-like conditions. Cabinet has then approved that farmers are now allowed to import fertilizers directly from suppliers outside the country in order to augment the local supplies, while it's the government of Zimbabwe develops a long-term comprehensive solution to the fertilizer challenges. Cabinet considered the report on the cement industry in terms of market supply and demand situation as presented by the Minister of Industry and Commerce, Honorable Dr. Stembiso Nyoni. The nation is advised that following reports of artificial cement shortages in the market and an increase in terms of the prices, Cabinet has approved, has approved the importation of cement by individuals and companies with free funds. Simba border captain Tinashe Balakasi has mounted a late surge for the PSL Golden Boot after scoring seven goals in the second half of the season to take his tally to nine, two behind Obriel Chirinda, who leads the way with 11 goals. CTN correspondent Tawanda Mtali filed the following report. Despite having started the season slowly, Simba Bora captain Tinashe Balakasi is one player who has stood up whenever his team needs him. Balakasi believes that his slow start to the season was due to fitness issues and now he has regained his fitness as he has struck a rich vein of form that saw him voted as the player of the month of October and is not putting himself under any pressure as he is aiming for the top prize. It's something which is good because if you look, uh, I, was, I was playing really uh, in the beginning of the season due to some injuries uh, because I didn't do much pre-season but Definitely, when when I I, I, I gained fitness, it started started coming up. So uh, I just I just think I just think that uh, 
It's all about fitness. If you are fit, everything, everything will go well. I'm not putting pressure on myself, but uh, obviously, I, I would like to take that goal.